going to take a look at the safety position now where uh, really was one of the strengths of the team last season, and that's due in large part to Landon Collins' emergence as really one of the best defensive players in the NFL. Uh, not something anyone really could have seen coming after kind of an up-and-down rookie year in 2015, but uh, he really took his game to the next level, uh, had huge impact on the rest of the defense, having a player playing at that level, uh, you know, at the strong safety spot. Uh, just so much more comfortable. Uh, they used him better, playing him close to the line, which really plays his strengths, but uh, he made some big plays when he you know had the opportunity in the passing game, so... Uh, having a guy like that, uh, you're looking at, you know, it looks like a perennial Pro Bowler for the next, you know, 10 years if, you know, he stays healthy and things go according to plan because uh, he's a young guy and he's a dominant force this year. Uh, the really question is, who's going to be that guy next to him? Uh, Andrew Adams did a phenomenal job as an undrafted free agent, really pressed into a tough spot. I mean, he was, you know, he didn't make the roster out of camp and, you know, four weeks later, he's taken over his starting free safety and held the job all the way right through until the playoff game where, uh, ben Mackin made a little bit of a questionable decision and, and benched him uh, in favor of veteran Leon Hall. But Adam showed a lot. Um, you know, he did kind of slip a little bit late in the season. Again, he is an undrafted free agent. Have to kind of temper the expectations. But uh, a guy who I think is, you know, giving great depth going forward. But the key, you know, X factor, I really think, uh, you know, on the entire defense is Darian Thompson. He's a guy that Giants were very high on last offseason. You know, was, you know, came in as a third-round pick took over as a starting free safety from day one in the offseason. I uh, just couldn't stay healthy. Got banged up with his shoulder in the preseason, then had a foot injury early in the season, was never able to really get back. I think he only played two games. Uh, so that's certainly uh, really almost a wasted year for him. Um, but, you know, he should be healthy, ready to go coming into next offseason. So I think they're going to count on him to be that guy. And, you know, at the level that Collins is playing, if you can get a good free safety next to him, uh, the defense could really be taken to another level. I think it's uh, you know a big factor uh, getting Thompson back, getting him healthy. Uh, so I think that you know that's a position that really should be strength for uh, a number of years. Those two guys.